Hello everyone. Uh, today I just want to show you uh, how I've done this uh, uh, chain of uh, poof stitch crochet, poof stitch crochet, and um, I'm almost at the end now. I have done quite a, a long, a long chain, and I want to show you how I'm finishing here, and then how I'm going to join uh, this uh, chain with these two loops here, something like this, but the only thing is I have to make this circle a bit larger, so when I will fold it and open, it will not gonna come out so easily like it does now. This chain is so long that uh, if I if I uh, fold into two, it's uh, something like this. So. Uh, I have used this method uh, of creating poof stitch which I showed you in a previous video and uh, if you want to see it again please make a click on the screen and go to that video to see how to make poof stitch. Now um, just to make sure that uh, this is going in the right direction I'm going to have to put it flat and uh, just uh, make some space here. So I'm put it I put this flat and follow 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 the chain like this and then come up come up come up come up 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 so this um I have to uh, crochet with red around the circle and uh, I'm using now a crochet hook of uh, three millimeters, and it's it's better, um, especially if this yarn is very thick. It's better to use a thinner crochet hook just because I find it's more easier to do the poof stitch. So now I'm here. I have joined in this way. You can see the chain with this uh, circle. So I have to make uh, two single crochet in each of this. Uh, uh, chain around the circle. So we insert the hook here and uh, we're gonna chain two and if two is too much you have to look at your circle then sometimes you'll do only one instead of two chains Sing sorry single crochet. So you go into the next one okay just a little bit uh need to pay attention here how we set okay and then again I think well one is enough here I'm going to do two here and one on this one every second um chain I will do two single crochets. So I have to do two single crochets here. Then I have to do one. Then here I have to do two. Here I have to do one. Oops, last two one then two then one So we've done one, then we need to do two here, then one, two here, and one, and two. Now when we close, we are coming here, we'll make sure we work underneath. 
so let's see if we are not pleased we can do it again uh, please how it looks like so it's gonna look like this okay so it's time for us to close here and I think um, we are done now but I suppose what we can do is make another single crochet and then a slip stitch for this one it's a better way of and a single crochet then we finished just cut the thread and this is how is coming your necklace so let's have a look doesn't matter which size we so again follow from here and going down and down and going down like that and like that and like that and like that so this is how it's looking up so far so now this um, I have to make it this larger when I will insert it here it's not gonna come out because it's, it's very large okay so this is the my system of closing up <laughs> the necklace so what we are going to do just insert this we have to secure this uh, end here so insert again like that and if we've done this one more time three times we've done that we will take um, a red thread a red color again and we will work around that circle there so it didn't work this way make a chain here a knot make a knot and insert insert your knot here and every second uh, make uh, two double crochets every second chain so one then here two double crochet two single crochet the next one we have one single crochet the next one we have two two the next one we have one uh, my, no actually we need two here because it's, it's not turning around very nice so here another two and then another one single crochet mm. okay and then another two in the next one here and another okay two here another one another single crochet and single crochet let's have a look how it looks like so far looking good and another single crochet and we are going secure through a slip stitch and that's it now let's check we need to check our work how it looks like wait a second here I I lost the secure knot so okay pull this loop below